But some birds construct even bigger buildings to impress females. And to see the most spectacular of all, you have to come to the dense forests of the islands north of Australia. Some females can be persuaded to mate for rewards that are more abstract than mere food and lodging. There's a kind of bird here in New Guinea whose females select a male not because he's a better meal ticket, but because he's a better artist. How else would you describe this wonderful construction except as a work of art? This is its creator, the Vogelkop bowerbird. He has a passion for interior decoration. His hut, almost big enough for me to crawl into, is neither a home nor a nursery. It's a gallery in which he can display his artistic creations to visiting females. These flowers come from a creeper that has only just started to bloom. Great new material for anyone who likes color. And he loves it. The iridescent wing cases of beetles also appeal to him, and he's amassed an impressive collection. But they're always in need of a little rearrangement to show them off to their very best advantage. He calls to invite female visitors. There are several such bowers in this part of the forest. A hundred yards away, there's another one, built by another male of the same species who has a slightly different artistic sense. If a female decides that this is the best selection of jewels, then she'll mate with the owner. So here, where living is easy, a female is not bowled over by practical things such as food or accommodation. It's beauty that wins her heart. And beauty can be found not only in jewels, but in costumes.